Hi guys, how's it going and welcome back to another match day vlog. It feels like absolutely ages since I've put out a vlog. And to be fair, it has been. It's been a good two to two and a half weeks since I actually put out a vlog. Obviously, we saw the penalty shootout on the channel uh, from the Exeter game, which didn't end how we wanted it to, but it is what it is. But other than that, there hasn't really been much content. But today we face Accrington Stanley at home. Um... Yeah, I don't know how it's going to go because you look at their recent form, I think it's they've conceded 15 in their last five league games. We've, we have we thought we'd conceded quite a lot in our recent games, obviously with the 5-0 loss to Sunderland, but, you know, we, we haven't conceded 15. It's not a good figure for us, but it's nowhere near as bad as Accrington's. Um, obviously, we've got home advantage. It depends on the team sheet we put out. At the end of the day today, it's going to come down to what I always say is the issue with us. Taking our chances. If we take our chances today, we win the game in my opinion. Same could even go for Accrington. I think it's just today, whoever takes their chances that they get is going to win the game. I don't think the defending is going to be good. I think it's either going to go one of two ways. It'll be high scoring or it'll be a nil-nil draw. Um, if I were to have to predict, I'm going to actually go for a 2-0 to Cheltenham. Now, I know I just said it's either going to be high scoring or a 0-0 draw, but I just have that bit of confidence inside me, and I don't know why. Um, obviously, it's the return of Harry Powell today to Wadden Road. Obviously, you know, brilliant in a Charlton Town shirt when he played here um, through the National League and League Two time. Um, Obviously, since then, he's played for Colchester and now, obviously, of Accrington. Uh, be interesting to see how he does. Hopefully, he doesn't score. Um, yeah, that, that that would not be ideal. But, yeah, if you do want to enjoy this video, please do like and subscribe. I would massively appreciate that. Your score predictions will be on the screen now. Yeah, I, I really don't know how I feel today, but I, I just got a little tinge of confidence inside me. Um, but we'll see how it goes. But, yeah, let's go down to the ground. Right then, so... The team sheet has just been released, and I'll be honest with you, I am very, very happy with that. I'll put it on screen now. Crowley starts. Boyle back in the squad. Vassell and Alfie May up top. Could, you know, play Joseph, but I haven't really looked in detail at the team sheet. I've just got after it. But the fact that Boyle's back, Crowley's starting, he's giving me optimism. And if Boyle can, you know, retain his fitness now, for the next couple of weeks, I think we could start to pick up form again because I, I do think Boyle was one of the main things we were missing in this team. But yeah, see you at the ground.
Nine minutes to go left of this half, nothing really much going on to be honest with you. Um, we've had a couple of half hearted chances, they've had a couple of half hearted chances, but it's neither side's you know, looking really threatening on the attack. Harry Pound was a bit all over the place, I've got to say. Um, I think the pressure's getting to him a little bit. Um, there's not really much to say on this first half, because to be honest, like I say, there has been attacking, but not not much of it and not to a good to a high intent if you like but uh, yeah it's not long till half time will we see a goal before then we'll have to wait and see Well, this isn't good, so we've just defended, uh, uh, defended an accident on attack. Perry's passed it to Vassell, and it looks like that player might have accidentally followed through. Nothing malicious. Um, but Perry is down, and he looks in quite some pain. Looking at his reaction to it, I think he'll be subbed off, but I just hope it's nothing severe, because obviously, you know, we've just had to bring in a midfielder. And Perry's been fantastic so far. Like in the recent games he's played in, he's been absolutely brilliant and it would not be good to lose him um, at this stage. But yeah, I can see him going off in this one, but hopefully he's all right.
Nice. Right then, full time, Cheltenham Town 1, Accrington, Stanley, nil. Deserved win. Definitely deserved win. We were the best side out of the two. Could have been more than one. Um, you know, we had, we, in the second half, we had three massive chances. One of them we scored, and the other two we kind of bottled a bit, but, you know, we took a bit too long to try and get it into the box and, you know, shift it across goal or whatever. Uh, that's, that's why we didn't score those, I think, but... Yeah, massive three points after, you know, what's been an awful run. And, you know, yes, it's been against good teams, but regardless, it's still good to get a result like that after a run that you don't want to have. And, you know, we proved today that when we've got the players that we need, we can easily stand this, we can easily stand the one this season. Like, Boyle was immense today. Boyle headed everything that came his way, as always, Mate, I I'm so happy with that result, and you know we've got we've got a few games coming up now. We've got Morecambe on Tuesday, and of course Doncaster next Saturday. I am going to both of those games, so hopefully we can maybe try and get three points across both games. And um, they're all they're both winnable. They are both winnable. Um, Morecambe, I'm not 100 percent sure because they're a bit hot and cold at the moment. Obviously, Cole Stockton. Ridiculous. Um, <clears throat> Doncaster again, a bit hot and cold. They sit, I believe they still sit bottom of the league, but that's nothing to judge on, you know. In, in this league, anything can happen. But yeah, that is it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please hit thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I would massively, massively appreciate that. We're on the road to 700 subs, so if you can help me hear that by the end of, I don't know, November or something, that would be massively appreciated. But yeah. You're all legends. Thank you for watching. Once again, have a class for the day. We'll see you in the next one.